First John 1 John 1.9 If we confess our sins, He is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Dear people, the cost paid for our sins was so costly, is so costly. The very Son of God has to come down from all the glory of heaven to take my place and your place and to die as a slave. What a great price it was. But still, the Lord asked us to confess our sins, to humble ourselves before God. For a real confession of our sins, there is a need of true humility of the heart, understanding our own inability to keep up the word of God, understanding our own failures in so many ways. What a good thing it is. Unless we are able to conf humble ourselves, we can't confess our sins. Here it is not a mere statement of words, but the attitude of the heart. When there is humility in the heart, there is a humble acknowledgement of the sins. The Bible says it's faithful. We have a faithful God. A God is faithful in his word. And just to forgive us our sins, not only to forgive us, and the Bible says to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Not part of them, no, completely. The cleansing of the Lord Jesus Christ of us through his blood is a complete one. And not even a fraction of our sin will remain there. And the condemnation of that sin will never have any dot on us. What a wonderful thing it is that we could really be cleansed and purified and stand righteous before God. It's nothing but a marvelous work of God in the life of a sinner. And everyone who is a child of God experiences this marvelous thing in their own lives and really it is a wonderful thing. Amen.